my channel Payal's Recipe. Today on the occasion of Valentine's Day, I will be sharing a very special recipe with you. I'm going to show you how to make an eggless red velvet cake right at home and it's very simple to make it. So let's get started. To make this eggless cake, the ingredients are 1 and a half cups of maida or all-purpose flour, 1 cup of powdered sugar, 1 teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of cocoa powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, 1 cup milk, half a cup of oil, 1 teaspoon of vinegar and 1 teaspoon of food color. So the first thing that we want to do is sieve all the dried powders. First goes in the all-purpose flour, the sugar, baking soda, baking powder and the cocoa powder. So we just sieve it to remove all the lumps and get a fine mix of powders. After sieving all the powders together, we use the milk which is kept at room temperature and put it in this bowl. Next goes in the oil and mix these two things and gradually we need to add the flour and keep mixing. Now goes in the vinegar and we also add some red color because this is a red velvet cake and we need this food color. And mix it again. Now that our batter is ready, we need to put it in this mold. I have this heart shaped mold because I'm making this special Valentine's Day cake. And I also have this uh, wax paper that I have lined uh, at the base or the bottom of the pan. And it's also greased well so it doesn't stick to the pan. And now I'm going to transfer this batter into this. So now we need to preheat the oven for about 350 degrees Fahrenheit and 10 minutes and I'm going to place this mold in the oven for about 30 minutes and recheck again at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. So the cake is ready and you can see the stick comes out clean and we have to take it out from this oven. So initially we estimated that it would take about 30 to 35 minutes in the oven but the actual baking time of this cake was 45 minutes. And now let the cake cool down for about 15 to 20 minutes before we do the icing. So now we just put this knife and we just turn this over And we just take this off and you can see this butter paper or wax paper it's still a little warm so I have transferred this cake on this cake stand and it's been cooling for about 10 minutes and you can see it looks good and you can have it as is but to decorate it a little more we are going to do some icing over it so now I'm going to ice this cake. I have some buttercream that I prepared. I'm just going to spread this on the cake. And we're going to ice it a little bit. Our red velvet cake is now ready. The icing may not be perfect, but you can make your own designs. It's the taste that matters more and I hope you enjoy eating and watching this recipe and for more recipes tune in till next time. Thanks for watching my video. Do like, subscribe and comment to my channel Piles Recipe. Till next time, bye bye.